Hashanah is coming. Oh, what day is Rosh Hashanah? What is Rosh Hashanah celebrating? What happened on Rosh Hashanah? Anybody? Creation of man. Thanks, Father. Awesome, right? Man was created. The world was created almost in, in only like two days from now, right? The creation of man. So what's the purpose of Rosh Hashanah? Everyone knows it's the day that we get judged. What does that mean? First of all, if we get judged, we know that we would probably fail in the judgment. Number two is how, how can we get judged once a year, maybe we should get judged the whole year. It's a very challenging thing. And how does that fit into the world of man getting created? So really, it's the day where man is recreated every year. And the question is like this. If you look into one of the pinnacle prayers, right? One of the most, most amazing moments of Rosh Hashanah is in Asana Tokev, right? Look in your boxer to see what exactly the whole story is behind it. One of the lines that never made sense to me is, right? The Kosev Yad uh, Koba is, is in there. Everyone's signature. It's in this book. What do you mean your signature? To read your report, what what you did? But why do you have to sign it? So there's this standard answer is, oh, because you signed off, this is what you did. But one of the most, more incredible answers I've seen is, Rosh Hashanah, you're recreating yourself, right? It's the new year. You went to Staples, and all of us did this, right? Went to Staples, waited in line for 500 hours. Rabbi Marchuk has a great tweet with the longest line ever in Staples, right? What did you do? You came into school with a brand new books and everything like that, and all the teachers, hopefully, they didn't have that before. They didn't have your brother or sister, right? Think you're going to do well. That's the same thing in Rosh Hashanah. The Rosh Hashanah says, "Where are you signing up?" This year? Everyone's signature is there. It's time to be recreated. Where are you signing up? Where are you going to sign the book? Are you in this year or not? Do you want to be on the team or not? Everyone's signature is there. It's judging for where are you going to be? That's why there's no we do it. There's no nothing. We don't repent. You sign up for where you want to be that year. It's an amazing thing. So I just want to share with you a story. And, and one, uh, and one uh, thought about the, uh, the chauffeur. I'm going to give you all a chance to go on and hand out. Uh, uh, there was one day a comment of the Balatan, which guy, and he was a businessman. The Balatan walks in uh, to this meeting, right? Uh, Weinberger told the story just recently. Walks in, and he sees this, the, and, and, you know, the rebel walks into the room, and the, the, you know, you're supposed to stand up, but the guy doesn't notice it. The guy's busy in his business, you know, filling out whatever, doing his homework and filling out all of the, uh, all of the, you know, I sold this much wine today, whatever, whatever he was selling, right? Uh, you know, I'm filling out the, uh, this, you know, the Slurpee guy. Let's say he owned the 7-Eleven, we have to, or Dunkin' Donuts guy. I sold this many donuts, and he's making a thing, and he's going to figure out for the month or for the year what he did. And at the end, you look, the Reb's looking over his shoulder, he doesn't notice, and he writes at the end, Sacha Cole, this is my final tally, right? And once he writes at the end, Sacha Cole, ain't old no vodka. You know, Nevado means there's no one else but their money. That's it. And really, that's the way we need to live our lives. We live in one world here where we have our basketball practice, we have our homework, we have our, our college work, whatever we're doing. But in the end, what's our goal? Where do we sign the book? Are you in the I'm going to party all night book or are you in the Anode Movado book? There's no one other than their version. So I want to tie that in a little with an amazing thought from her pink and looking right to it. This is on my uh, standard that I put in every year. I have like a little thing, I put it on my center for, for Rosh Hashanah and Kippur. So I'll give you that also, I, I, I include that, right? Pinka says, if you go to Simcha's Torah, you get to Simcha's Torah, you start off, they take the Simcha's Torah, this is the, the moment that you've waited for. It's actually from the beginning of Elul till Simcha's Torah, Simcha's Torah is the end of our whole thing, right? How do we start off? With that exact puzzle. We start off with Atar Reis Das, right? He ain't no novato, right? That there's no one other than Shem. The whole purpose of everything we're doing is to get to that one level of Saha Kol, Eno Novato, which really means for guys that you know, which really means what? If you remember the story correctly, right? Anybody remembers when they were waking camp, right? It really means what does it mean Eno Novato? What does it mean signing the book? It means that you're just going to get up and dance when Rosh Hashanah comes. You're going to decide in your life. This is the, when Rosh Hashanah is there, and you're, you're, you know, you all of the all of Davani comes down to it. It's really you want to get to, to Eno Novato. Uh, I'll add one amazing story that is a little sensitive, but. I, I, I can't not say it. There was a, a guy from MTA, no, I don't know if there's other guys, right? Uh, unfortunately, there was someone from MTA, uh, one of the seniors who just went there to show, and uh, the first weekend uh, passed away on a hike. The parents are the most amazing people I've ever met in my life. The parents are going to show after Sukkot. Why? Because they want to tell the kids in the yeshiva, these are parents who lost their only child. They want to tell the kids in the yeshiva, you know, the kid, you might think that there's no purpose in this world because how could something like this happen? Parents said, if we're the parents, if we know that the Barashalm has a cheshman, the Barashalm said, God said, you know what? He's on, he, he was on his way up, learning for a week, amazing, 
take him while he's on a high. The parents believe this, we need to tell the kids. If we believe this, now, the parents said, honestly, we don't know how we're going to get by an island. But it's not because we doubt Hashem. He had a head head. Okay. That is the most quintessential story of Nino Mavazo I've ever heard in my life. I think, possibly, and I, I met these people, actually went to Levi and had to go back for a Shiva call. How many times do we go to Shiva call for someone who has a Q? But pre Rosh Hashanah, our, our, our main focus should be Nino Mavazo. That's why Cook says in a different Shatim, I'll give you two quick Shatim. What's the main mitzvah of Rosh Hashanah? To get a chauffeur, right? To get a chauffeur is the main mitzvah of, of Rosh Hashanah. Why do we blow the chauffeur? Can anybody give me a definitive reason? No. How many people here think, while they're blowing a chauffeur, what am I doing? Am I Mekai and Mitzvah? All I know is one thing. We're taught one thing about blowing a chauffeur. Don't talk. Right? If you talk, it's all over. You're not allowed to talk to me. get it right? We all, yeah! Right? But it's a Mitzvah. We should do it with a positive realm. We should think about what we're doing. The, the uh, Alexander Rebbe says, Tekiah chauffeur reminds us of the guy's healthy, you're born, the year started. Oh, look, Tekiah, I'm all strong. Then you start coughing a little, you start slowing down, it starts getting even worse. Remember, the new year starts, or remember your original thing? Come back to Tekiah. We can always come back and re- don't get down. Rav Cook says, oh, wait, I'll just show you. Sh- anybody know how big a chauffeur has to be? Anybody? The shear in the Gemara is, it has to be seen outside your hand on both sides. Gemara says it has to be able to be seen on the hand. What does that mean? So Rav Cook says, because know that certain times things will be hidden. A chauffeur can't totally be hidden. In your life, on the one side, you'll be able to see clearly. Those are two different little things about Tekiah Shofar. Uh, you know, there's there's a lot of different uh, shentles on, on why and, and reasons why we blow Tekiah Shofar. But you should think while they, while you're doing it, that Eno Novado, and that is a memory to that. And it's easy to do, because it's simply where you want to sign up. It's not so hard. Then you have to work through, oh yeah, that's the challenge, right? Make sure that all your material from staples get you to that.